Hi, Wes Scott from Life Back Law. Today we're going to talk about can gambling debt be included in bankruptcy? You know, a lot of our guests, a lot of people have uh, gambling addictions. And of course, that is a medical problem. Um, and it's not to be, it's no different than anything else. Uh, if you're an alcoholic, if you're a drug addict, um, gambling is, and uh, gambling and addiction, addiction, if I could spit it out, is, it's a sickness. And, and, you know, we hope people get help for their sicknesses, of course. Um, but the gambling debts are dischargeable in bankruptcy. And I think there's a lot of times people kind of feel squiggly about that. Um, and I'm not sure why. Because honestly, when you're gambling, what are you thinking? What you're thinking is, I'm going to hit the mother load, right? I mean, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to win money. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make money. In my mind, it's really no different than being in a business. Um, you, you start businesses to make money. You go gambling in your mind um, when you have an addiction to make money. And, and the debt that results from that, it's dischargeable in a bankruptcy. Um, now, creditors can object to you discharging debts if they think it was incurred through uh, by fraud. But how do you... If I take a $5,000 cash advance on a credit card to gamble, how is that fraud? I mean, I didn't... I meant to win money and and pay it back and, and and have a surplus. Like, that's not fraud. So when the time is right, when you are ready to get your life back, reach out to Life Back Law Firm. You're going to be so thankful you did.